This is JITEX, the Golf Information Technology Expo, the biggest tech show in the Middle East. More than 4,000 exhibitors from 100 different countries turned up this year. What really stands out at JITEX compared to all the other tech conferences we see around the world is the amount of money governments in this part of the world are pouring into tech. Not just the amount of money they're investing in tech companies, but the way they're trying to guide tech startups in their nations to innovate to meet the needs of the Gulf region. Isn't it annoying having to walk back to your car just to place your parking ticket on the dashboard, especially in our hot weather? This is one of the more meaningful inventions that I've seen at JITEX. It's a water robot, and I love the idea because it's so basic. It just has a net and it's going around picking up garbage that's in the water, and then at the end the net will come up so that it collects everything and it can't go back out again. Other bits of tech here are more lighthearted. This robot's making me nervous. This whole setup may look like a gimmick, but it actually demonstrates incredibly well how little of a chance man has versus machine. Ha! Take that! But they often display just how far machines and robots have come in recent years. And for Dubai, it means being at the front and center of the latest technology developments. This is rolling all around the floor, but it's not a vacuum cleaner. It's actually all part of the research into automating vehicle inspection. So this would go under your car, take pictures, and send that back to an algorithm that's trying to figure out what's wrong with your car, and then it will text you that information. I don't have a car anymore. If you don't like looking in your rear view mirror and seeing blue and red lights flashing, imagine this showing up behind you or over you. This is a quadcopter that Dubai is experimenting with, not to give out traffic tickets, but more for things like search and rescue. Each unit will set a municipality back about $150,000. Yes, I asked to take a ride. No, they wouldn't let me.